a wall. Simply click on the starting point, specify the direction where the wall should head and type in how long the wall should be. We are able to use an existing DWG or DXF CAD drawing to draw three-dimensional walls. Click on the line close to the endpoint and do the same thing close to the other endpoint. Then click on the opposite face and the wall is created. The wall thickness is calculated automatically. Of course, walls can be multi-layered too. Each layer can have individual parameters and 2D representations. Customize the function of the layer, add the material, thickness and also don't forget to specify the proper hatch pattern. You can also bind the layers to different points of your floor structure. This means that if the floor height is ever changing, the wall layers will follow the changes automatically. Curved walls is quite simple, just type in the necessary values and the software will create the right result. Walls can be drawn as splines too, this way any kind of organic shape can be created. You can place doors and windows into your walls with the drag and drop method. You can move their position on the floor plan and also on the 3D. Use the markers and stickers you can find to modify the openings any way you want. The shape of the walls can be modified easily. You can draw polylines, arcs, splines into the wall frontal profile and this is how we can draw unique shapes. The wall cross section profile can be modified with this method as well. Creating wall recess, niche or bay windows is quite easy. Define the values and the parametric element will be inserted into your wall. Both faces of your walls can be reshaped individually, independent from each other. For this you can use polylines, lines and splines and you can rework your walls any way you want. You can create framed wall constructions down to the last tiny detail. If you want to enable or disable the visibility of the wall framing, you can do that too with just a few simple clicks. There are predefined ways in the software in terms of how you want to show your walls on the floor plan. Choose the representation style that best fits your purposes. 